Greetings, YouTube. Danny Staten here on that Danny Staten channel. Before I get started, I want to tell everybody you should go over to the Daddy Dan blog and check out the video that's probably up already over there. Oh my god. My neighbors who live right over yonder, his kids ran in the house. They said, Daddy, we just saw this giant bear looking thing run through the woods. And then we heard this loud, crashy noise. And did Daddy call me and tell me about it? I came over and talked to him. He said it was upright, like a man, running. And I don't think bears do that, so I decided to uh, grab my cameras and run down here and start making videos. The first ones up, uh, I recorded was on the Daily Dan blog. And after I found some interesting stuff, I decided I was going to make a channel, a video for the Danny Staten channel. So I'd have two videos recording this incident, because it's only like 200 yards from my house. And that makes it great that actually getting a little action up here. And it's been almost a week now. Last Saturday night, I had action. Hadn't been much else going on, no howls or nothing else since much. I heard about. But I got down here five minutes after everything happened on the Daily Damn Dog. And I actually heard a couple of roary growl sounds. I don't know if they picked up on camera. And then I found some interesting evidence of something strange. And you know I like to document evidence, so I decided to walk, to walk back up here where I was at, restart on the Danny Staten channel, and show you this. As I was coming down right through here, I noticed where a bunch of disturbance was on the ground right here. Like something had crossed this fence right here. Then I realized that the fence was bent down to make it easier to cross. And I found that really peculiar. But here's what was really kicked me off, and I'm gonna have to go back to the house now and collect a paper sack and come all the way back down here because I don't want to touch nothing, but I will show you. Check this out. This is for Jeff. I don't I rarely find any evidence on investigations when somebody says something. And I'm not saying this is anything more than where a bear crawled across the fence. I'm really not at this point. But I'm gonna collect this and maybe even have it sent off for a little analysis and check this out. This seems to be some furry hair stuck here and here. Jeff, if you're watching this video or Joe, let me know in the comments below what you think about this. Something crawled across this fence and hair got stuck. And look right here, it even got stuck on the briars. The briars going over the fence even clipped whatever the hell it was. And I'm not saying this wasn't a bear. The kids said they saw a bear. But how much does eight-year-olds know about what they're looking at when they see a big hairy creature in the woods? Maybe they just assumed it was a bear. I do not know. As a matter of fact, I was said that one of the kids had only seen it from the back. and It could have been anything. But it's more proof that something does lurk around in my neighborhood. It's more proof that there is something more than just nature happening here. Let me know in the comments below what you think, and let me know if you see anything I miss. Because I'm holding the camera way far away from me to get a good look, and I can't even see what's recording on it right now. Anything could be hiding over there under that damn thing, that old truck part over there where that wheel well is. I don't know if you can see it or not. It would make a perfect cave for something to crawl up in like a bear. Yeah, it's just not, you know. That would make a perfect cave. I can't get over there to have a look. But what I can do is show you that hair has been stuck here and here. And I think the other piece might have fallen. Huh. Right, there it is down on the ground. I'll come back and collect that later. And I'll be willing to send it to anybody that wants a little taste of it. Let me know in the comments or email me, Jeff, if you want me to send that to you. Well, like I said, I'm going to creep down and have another look around. I done done this once on the Daily Damn Blog. After what somebody told me a couple of weeks ago about seeing something swinging through the trees, they got me wanting to look up and make sure there ain't nothing hanging in a tree up over my damn head. Now, this crazy little kid said they saw monkeys or something swinging from tree to tree. I went out and investigated that. 
there's just so much junk down here below my house. Old truck beds and just actually abandoned vehicles. Anything can make a home down here. And stay hid most of the day up under stuff like this or up under something like this. And nobody would even know it was here. And at dark, it could come out and be a predator. It may, whatever's going on or whatever comes up in my yard sometimes and steals my trash or messes around. I heard something. I heard something again, a dog barking at something and a growly noise. I heard that growly noise earlier. You can see the trail where something went down that way. Wow. Anyway, this is Danny Staten on the Danny Staten Channel giving you a look at what's going on in my neck of the woods here in South Carolina. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And join me on my next video, which I'll start immediately after this one, but I don't know when you'll see it. Till next time, blog over.